In this video, I'm going to show you how to integrate email signature software with Google Analytics. So this is going to let you track site traffic generated by your email signature and feed information on that straight into Google Analytics or any web analytics platform because we're going to track it based on click tags. I'll show you in a second. So you could maybe track which departments generate the most clicks, maybe which users or any attribute like country or office. First, I'm going to add a clickable link. In this case, it'll be a clickable banner image, but it could be say hyperlink text, could be even a social media icon, whatever you want. Then we're gonna add a URL that it will link to. And within that URL, we'll add a field that will be auto completed. So you could do it based on department or sender name, and then we're gonna test and we're gonna make sure that works. So let's get started. So here I am in my demonstration environment. You can see I've got my banner image on the signature. And that's feeding information on who clicks on that into Google Analytics. I could do this in Template Editor. I can do this in Signature Manager Exchange Edition. I can do this in Signature Manager Outlook Edition. You can do this in our entire Signature Manager range. So first I'm going to click Edit. And then I'll go to that clickable content, this banner. Like I said, this could be text for you, and I'm just gonna make it so that we can see which departments are generating clicks on there. So here's what I've done. In here, I've got the URL as standard, and then at the very end, you can see that I have a field, department. So that means that's gonna be automatically completed using each user's AD department field. But I could choose another one. So I did go and I selected a department, but you could maybe go on title, we could do manager, we could do maybe office. However your organization is structured, you could use a different field. So I'll click OK. And then when I click preview, I can just click on that banner and we can see where it would go to. So let's expand that. Great. And so now we can see that we have the full website URL and at the end we have Karen's department name. So now in Google Analytics, I can compare. I can see which department is getting the most clicks. I can see sales has so many clicks, marketing has so many, and I can compare. I can plot rows, as Google Analytics would call it. I could maybe set up different segments. There are multiple ways to access this information. I can go to all pages, I can go to landing pages, and I can select those and just click plot rows, as I mentioned, so that I can see which ones are generating the most clicks and compare. Perfect. Thanks for watching.